what up guys Johnny here I'm uh, just showing you guys how to get to the pyro lady and uh, which lady she'll upgrade your pyro hand once it's at plus 15 to plus 5 of a stronger version but you have to have plus 10 to get to her so you come down this hill where you from where you fought Quaylag, but go down on the right side to avoid those guys stone rocks and you should be safe here. I think they don't come attack you. But the rocks guys might throw uh, then their th th throw the rocks and hit the witch lady here. You don't want them to do that. But you need to have your hand at plus ten to be able to s see her, otherwise she won't appear. And then you can upgrade it here. And I was just here, and I learned great fireball, which was twenty thousand souls, I believe, maybe ten thousand, one of those. And great combustion. I suggest getting great combustion and maybe combustion again because it's really cheap. <laughs> and then fire orb, I guess, if you still have spells. Firestorm and fire whip, whip look and sound pretty good, but they kind of suck when you use them. At least when I tried them. No you only can use it like once or twice. It says 80 uses, but it uses like 60 of them the first time. So now I'm just going to be running back to Fire Link. And then going to the blacksmith. The bonfire by the blacksmith. I think we're gonna go to the forest after this and beat the moonlight butterfly. Maybe to Sin's fortress. One or the other. Here's combustion. Works pretty good on these guys. See, the magic's doing quite a bit of damage now. Oh, there's an item down there. I don't know if it's anything great. Don't remember what it is in my other game. I think I did get that. If somebody does get that, go ahead and leave it in the comments saying what it is so other people can know if it's worth getting. So you want to go up this ladder here to get back to the uh, next ladder to go to the shortcut back to Fire Link. But. Get a little confused. <laughs> like, oh. Yeah, it is that ladder. And I'm poisoned right now, not really a big deal. So you go up this ladder, and then you go up this ladder, and then we're gonna be going up two more ladders. I see more ladders. Hmm. Quite a few ladders. And I came back down this way, that's why this guy's already dead. So you might need to fight him though. Or just run by. Either way. Because uh, I had already recorded the video when I got the spells, but somehow I couldn't find it on my other computer. And I'm not going back, <laughs> hooking the computer back up to try and find it. Because I just got a new one. And there would be guys right here as well. That you can run by pretty easily though. And I'm not sure why I'm still wearing this armor. Guess I don't want to be running slower by equipping the other one. As you can see, I still don't have the boots on. And we're going back to Firelink. So, you guys really don't need to be watching the rest of this video. Unless you want to see me run back to the bonfire. If you don't know how to do that, then yeah, I guess go ahead and watch. And then I'm going to go upgrade my shield at the blacksmith. And when you get right at the top of these stairs, you will see there will be some items right by this jail cell, or whatever this is, where the lady is dead. And it's her armor and a black stone thing that you can use to invade uh, the knight Lettrick that killed her. 
later on in the game and oh, get her back. Because right now we can't use the Firekeeper soul. So be careful when you talk to this guy. He says he's never seen anything like the other chaos. He's referring to our chaos fireball spell. I believe if you say no, he will still be here. And you can come back to upgrade at him later on. But I believe I said yes in my first playthrough, and then he becomes an enemy in New Lundo or in the swamp area somewhere. One of those. And you can't use him to upgrade your hand anymore. And I was always coming back there like, what the heck, how do I get him to come back? I need to upgrade my pyro hand. I was stuck at like plus four or something. I didn't realize that the egg guy by the Chaos Fire or Chaos uh, Covenant actually will upgrade your pyro hand as well. So, just making the run back. Like I said, not doing much in the rest of this video or throughout most of this video. If you know how to get back to the blacksmith and the spawn fire. Because that's all I did. I was like, I don't really need to include this, but people may <laughs> not be sure exactly where to go. And I say, oh yeah, go back to this bonfire. they are like, oh, how do I get there? So, this is how you get there. And right now I'm debating where I want to go. And I'm going to give him the large ember we just got. And he can reinforce your weapons and armor and modify equipment once you get a certain what weapon to like plus five or so. I'm debating what do I want to upgrade? <laughs> kind of just going in circles. Do I want to go to the forest or to Sin's Fortress? There's a pretty good item you can get. Somewhat early on in Sin's Fortress. Well, it's not that early on, actually. Probably almost done with the level. I'm halfway through, at least. So, I'm just coming over here. I believe I just kill these two lizard guys, and I run back and upgrade my shield. Showing you guys this trap. It was right to the left of where I walked. But you can lure these guys down and then use the trap to kill them. Just walk over it. You might want to put your shield up too in case it goes by them so it doesn't own you. Free fireball and I missed. Great combustion, yeah that's pretty good. See I'm really liking this spell. It's not one shotting those guys but it's pretty good. I decided I wanted to upgrade my shield for a boss we fight later on. Helps to have a shield upgraded and having more stability on your shield. So I wasn't sure which shield I want to upgrade though. You could probably just use the spider shield. Or that crest shield that had good magic damage reduction. Uh, this one looked good because it already had the highest ability other than this eagle shield, but the eagle shield is a large shield that you can't use to parry. So, I <laughs> haven't used the shield at all yet, but I decided I will upgrade this well, one. And if it ends up being one that I don't really like, I can just upgrade it when, with the moonlight butterfly soul we're going to get soon. And you can get a pretty good shield. Well, it has a good attacking ability. It's not really good at shielding. But it will do like six, 700 damage when you use it to attack. I'm just checking out what shields he has here. So, Hollow Soldier Shield. Stability is at 60. Go ahead and upgrade that. And now I need to purchase items. About 
two okay, more of those. Yourself. I can upgrade it once more. <laughs> I need another 40 souls to be able to do that. I'm gonna use my weakest item here. Well, you need. There we go. So, this video was kind of uh, lame, didn't really do much. So, <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next video when I'm going to go to take on the Moonlight Butterfly. Alright, I will see you guys then. Now, these are just the spells I have. And it looks pretty good. I like them. I uh, should be able to uh, go through the next level pretty easily with these spells here. Alright, see you guys next time.